Hi, it's Jim in Atlantic British. I take care of the technical support here. Today we're going to discuss cooling systems, things to look at, things to replace. This is a Discovery 2. A real common problem on these cars, first, is the radiators leak. If you haven't done one, you're going to do one, maybe two. In hoses, like the upper hose, I have some of the covering take it off so you can see this. This is the upper radiator hose. Over and back are the ones that run into side to the heater. If we come back out here again, a big big thing to know is right here in this top hose, this is where you bleed the air out if you're doing a coolant change or a hose change. Here at Atlantic British, we'll show you a little later, you can buy a complete hose kit for this car in most Rovers. I would say all Rovers. Another thing to look at, and it's a real common thing on these cars, is over here at the throttle housing. If you can see where these two lines go in, one goes down into the intake manifold, the other one goes all the way over to the coolant reservoir. There's a throttle heater plate here that has a real problem with leakage. We sell a kit to replace it. The kit comes with the gasket and another plate. Also three bolts. Some people can do it with it in place. There's like four bolts. You can just take this throttle housing out and do it. It's a real common problem. You'll see antifreeze actually laying on your valve cover. It's probably a good idea with these cars, I would say at least every 30,000 miles to change the coolant. It turns to acid, it starts to eat stuff up. If we go around back, I have a kit and I can show you the hoses that come for this car. Here in the back of the car we have the hose kit for this truck start showing you get the upper kit the upper hose has the new bleeder and everything in it this is the hose that goes down to the thermostat as you can see these come with the clamps they're real easy to operate just squeeze them with a pair of pliers move it back put the hose on squeeze it move it back in place as I said, most of them come with the clamps. We also sell a clamp kit for the hoses that don't have it. As you notice, this is the one that goes into the heater. It doesn't have the clamps. It actually shows you where they want the clamp to be. You can order your hose kit here at Atlantic British at RoverParts.com or give us a call at 1-800-533-2210. Talk to our sales staff. They can definitely run you through the hose kit, and actually they know all about that throttle body heater. And keep following us on YouTube, you'll learn a lot about your truck.